How's it going everyone? My name is Lunar and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another Danger Zone video. In today's video, I'm going to go over the top three things that need to change in my opinion. But before we hop into those three things, I'd like to thank you all for your massive support lately on all of these Danger Zone videos. You all are absolutely amazing. And if you haven't seen my most recent Danger Zone video where the AK-47 drop saved my life in a full Danger Zone match, then be sure to check that out by clicking the card up in the top right. Now, these three things things are mainly opinion based and things that I feel would help the game mode as a whole. These are not complaints or me crying about the game mode because I have a ton of fun playing it as it is now and I'd love to see all of your thoughts on these three things or other things you feel should be changed down in the comments. For the first thing though I would like to look at and I think it's really the most frustrating thing that I'm sure has happened to a lot of you. In the beginning of the game when you initially drop it's not finding a gun after going through multiple houses or multiple different areas where you might have found a gun before. Now, I really feel that more weapons should be dropped around the map. I'm not saying drop M4s or FAMASs or something crazy like that that does a lot of damage. I'm just suggesting a starter pick pistol like a Glock or P2000. I feel this would help make the games a little bit of a faster pace, which is how Danger Zone was designed to be. People would spend less time trying to hunt for a single weapon, and it would create more gunfights in the game, thus making it more interesting, especially in the beginning. I also found this mainly pertains to playing duos or playing threes, not necessarily solo because you're just hunting for loot for yourself and you only have to gear up yourself, but those who have played duos or threes will definitely understand the struggle that you that happens when it comes to finding a gun or having to find a gun for multiple people and having multiple people around you trying to kill you now the second thing i feel should be changed is ammo in a weapon now hear me out on this because there is more than enough shots in every gun to kill someone with the amount of ammo loaded into it after picking it up especially if you hit headshots but say you get into a gunfight with someone and you maybe have two bullets left and someone else pushes you you are pretty much dead especially when playing duos or threes because there are still more people than the one guy you initially killed that you have to kill. Of course, you can call in ammo or try to scavenge it for another gun, but until then, you're very vulnerable and can easily die at any time without being able to give a fighting chance. Now, this does go along with the first tip where I said putting more guns down in general. It's almost nearly impossible to try and find another gun, especially if the two players, the one person you killed and yourself, have looted the areas nearby. Now, you can always pick up your enemy's weapon, but what if they are completely out of ammo as well? Then you're back to the same situation to where you have to call for ammo and run to hope you find another weapon. And if you're late in the game, that's almost nearly impossible to find a weapon laying around. And if you're early in the game, you might not have enough money to buy ammo. So with that being said, I'm not saying weapons should have full ammo. It makes sense for them to not have that much ammo when you initially find them. But at least putting in a full magazine of ammo into each weapon with no backup ammo rather than only 5 to 10 bullets with no backup ammo. I feel like that would help a lot and also, you know, help especially in duos and threes. Now, the third thing goes along with the previous tip and that is to adjust the amount of ammo you pick up at a time. At the time of this video, you have to grab ammo one at a time either by holding E or tapping E on the ammo crate. I can understand why this is done and that's so that way you can actually split ammo and whatever amount you'd like between the two guns you have because guns like the CZ don't take up all the ammo in the ammo crate and always have some left over. Now the reason I feel like this should be changed is because of these two clips you're about to see on screen where I kill two people because they are in the middle of picking up ammo. I do feel I just had good timing and good positioning when they started picking up the ammo, but if it was changed to where you only have to click E twice or hold down E for two seconds to pick up half of the ammo each time rather than every single bullet, it would have put these two people that I snuck up on in a better situation to actually take a gunfight, and that way you can still split ammo between the two weapons if needed. You'd pick up half with one gun and half with the other. Now, this would also play into the faster pace and less time spent looting, and I'm sure almost everybody has died while trying to pick up ammo for a gun. 
I mean, if you haven't, then you're lucky, and I wish I was you because there's been multiple times where I've died while trying to pick up ammo. Now, these are the three main things that I feel could be changed or updated to improve Danger Zone. These things can change after the time of this video, of course, by either updates, you know, down the road or shortly after, so please keep that in mind. Now, I hope you all enjoyed the video, and if you did, leave a like and let me know what you all feel needs to be changed in Danger Zone in the comments, or let me know how you all feel about my suggestion to the changes that I feel should be made. Also, if you'd like to see more CSGO content, whether that be more Danger Zone videos, general tips and tricks for matchmaking videos, or my Road to Global series, then hit subscribe to see more. My name is Lunar, and I'll catch you all with another video tomorrow. <laughs>